every two seconds we lose a football field of rainforest due to deforestation. And as we can see here, that's largely driven by agriculture. So we have taken on this problem and are monitoring forest conservation projects like agroforestry with machine learning and drones. Now, the issue of deforestation and forest degradation is so big that it accounts for 15% of all global greenhouse gas emissions. And international stakeholders like the UN Red Program, Google or Microsoft have realized that that's a problem and they're paying landowners for agroforestry, for example, in the form of carbon credits. But in order to receive the money, landowners need to quantify how much carbon exactly are they storing in their forests. The problem with that is monitoring forest carbon is very, very difficult. Most of the time, people are actually going through the forest like I did here in Peru, and then you take a tape measure and you measure the diameter, height, and the species of every tree you see. But you can imagine that's gonna take an eternity and why being accurate, it's incredibly expensive. So on the other hand, you can measure carbon from satellite, but due to the low resolution, you will mostly be able to see whether the area is forested or not. So the carbon estimates are very inaccurate. So right now there exists no affordable or accurate solution to monitor small scale forest conservation projects. So what we're proposing is the machine learning based estimation of forest carbon from drone imagery. And it works like this. A landowner on the left contracts a drone owner to create a map of their forest. The landowner then uploads the imagery to MIT and we run a machine learning algorithm to extract the tree height and species from which you can calculate the forest carbon. The main issue is that there exists no global data set to train or transparently benchmark the used algorithms. So we're creating one forest, a global open access species data set. And for creating this data set, we've created machine learning algorithms that ensure the data privacy of the landowner and verify the integrity of the reported imagery, which has also won a best proposal award at a major AI conference. So thank you very much for your attention. Uh, thanks to our collaborators and special thanks to Sandro Pimentel, the conservationist on the top right of this rainforest we can see here and who took me two years ago after I cold called him to the rainforest and actually sparked all of this.